Football has always been one of the most popular sports in high school, but this year there has been a drastic drop in numbers. I think, like a lot of things, it's a combination of things. I think West opening, we lost some kids to West. I think that's part of it. Um, and also, overall, numbers are down across the nation in high school football. And I think that is attributed to um, the, the fear of concussions and injuries and that sort of thing. But that's just uh, me guessing, to be honest. I feel like a lot of parents don't want their kids playing due to concussions because it, it really affects their overall life. Like, their grades could go down because they've had concussions day after day, going in and out of practice and games. And it's a very physical sport and it's very tough. And you just kind of have to go in with that mindset that it's going to happen. And if your parents really believe in that you want to play and that you want to do this for the sport, then I don't think concussions really matter in the long run. So. A lot of the students who came out have higher hopes for their life regarding football. I feel like making a career out of it would be anyone's dream in football, but you know, it's something that we all have the same dream for, so I want to play football eventually in life, and so this is the first step. So, Despite the smaller than usual team, the freshman football players are looking forward to a great season. Uh, the boys we have are working hard, and we've had a good summer, and I'm excited. and and. Like I told the boys um, early on this summer, I said, we're going to worry about who's here. And we're going to work hard and do our best. And we want to get better each and every day. And, and we, we're, we're going to have a great season. That's our plan. For ONW Now, this has been Lena Satterin. Now back to the desk.